Hi viewers, good day. Welcome to vSparks. Today we are going to see an overview of data center migration to Google Cloud Platform. We are going to discuss about the migration assessment program conducted by Google, different types of data center migrations and its relevant products available in Google Cloud Platform to carry out the migration. If you like this video, please subscribe to vSparks channel and click the bell icon for the latest updates. This is the agenda of this video. We are going to discuss on these topics in this video. What is migration? Migration is actually a journey that contains multiple processes to follow. Moving your applications, servers, network, storage, etc. from one environment to another target environment is called as migration. In our case, the source environment is our on-premises or any other cloud and the target environment is Google Cloud Platform. Google has standardized its migration process into a phased model and there are about four phases to carry out and they are the first phase is assessment phase which evaluates your IT infrastructure landscape and workloads. Second is planning phase that gives us a decision on what to move and what not to. Third is migration phase that kickstarts the actual migration. Fourth is optimization phase that automates manual jobs to save our costs. To simplify your cloud migration journey across each of the four phases and to help to reduce the migration risk and costs, Google introduces a program called RAMP. RAMP stands for Rapid Assessment and Migration Program and it's a holistic end-to-end -end migration program that helps Google Cloud customers to enable a simpler and faster path for migration. With this RAMP, you can evaluate your current landscape and total cost for migration with a complementary assessment. Yes, of course, the assessment is free from Google. RAMP is actually built on six key pillars to meet your cloud adoption and onboarding needs. They are guidance from Google, professional training on Google Cloud, the tools that drives migration quicker, trusted Google partners who can actually help to move, build and work in Google Cloud, Google Cloud's professional services, and at last the offers from Google Cloud. Now we can see the types of migration that you can do with Google Cloud Platform. There are basically three different types of migration. They are re-hosting, that is lift and shift, re-platform, that is lift and optimize, and refactor, that is move and improve. We will see one by one in the next few slides. Moving your applications, servers to Google Cloud without changing the underlying platform and application code is called as re-hosting. In other words, it is called as lift and shift. For example, if you are running your on-premises workloads in VMware environment or platform, you can actually move this on-premises VMware workloads to Google Cloud VMware engine with zero changes. There is no change in your application code and there is no change in your underlying environment or platform. In other words, your underlying platform remains the same VMware from source to destination. And this is why this is called lift and shift. These are the products that's available under lift and shift category. The first one is Google Cloud VMware engine that is used to run your on-premises VMware workloads in Google Cloud. Second is bare metal hardware to run your specialized workloads like Oracle. Database tools to shift your on-premises DB to Google Cloud. Now the second type of migration is re-platform. 
moving your applications servers to google cloud without rewriting your code but with a different underlying cloud native platform is called as re platform it is also termed as lift and optimize here there is a product called as migrate for compute engine formerly called as velostrata that moves your on prem vm workloads or any other cloud vm workloads to google cloud compute engine for hardware optimization in this scenario the underlying platform is changed but there is no changes to your application code the last type is refactor or move and improve it is also called as rip and replace in this type of migration your traditional vm based applications are converted to the modern form factors such as containers without rewriting the application code we have a product called as google cloud anthos that takes the apps running on the on premises vms and automatically transform them into containers that is going to run in google kubernetes engine here the underlying vm based platform is changed to a modern form factor called as containers and of course there is no changes in your application code similarly we have a database migration that transforms your existing traditional db into google cloud spanner or upgrade your data warehouse to bigquery to achieve maximum performance with cloud native solutions continue to modernize continue to modernize your environments with the google cloud native evolutions like serverless and container technologies by simply migrating your legacy applications or rewriting your existing applications or you can create a new application to extract the maximum benefit out of google cloud platform here are some of the products from google cloud that makes your application more modernized this is the summary of this uh, video which we have discussed for the past few minutes thank you for watching this video and thank you from vspark team